Though the learners took out their hairstyles when NBC News arrived at the school premises, we found them hanging around the school premises and not allowed to write their exams until their parents apparently apologized to the school principal, according to one of their parents. If you are having rastas in your head and you are about to write exams in 20 minutes, do, you honest, do the teachers honestly think those kids are going to finish and plating those hair? in time for the exams, because they also said they are not going to write those exams with half heads. We came to the school to negotiate with the principal, so we were having a decent conversation with him. And then he just burst out saying we should go to hell and get out of his schoolyard. According to the principal of the school, rules are there to be obeyed, and he refused to comment any further. Since the beginning of the year, the learners allege that they have been coming with braided hair and apparently this rule only changed during the exams. At the beginning of the year, when the first day of school, when, you, when the girls come with braided hair to school, send them home so that we know from the start it's not allowed. Yeah, let us they told us the previous day that we should unplait our hair and I asked them nicely if I cannot remove the hair in the weekend since it was a lot. Now I just want to know, is it me writing the exams or my hair? Varda Biekas is a grade 10 learner and she's missing out on her regional exams. I feel very unhappy. I feel very bad. It was one of my best subjects. Contacted for comment, the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture said the matter was brought to their attention and the inspector was sent to the school to assess the matter. Selima Henok, NBC News, Khrodob.